The objective of our work is to perform agile and accurate trajectory tracking on sub-gram micro-aerial vehicles such as the MIT Softfly, which only weighs 0.7 grams thanks to its high-power density actuators. Control of insect-scale aerial robots is challenging. First, manufacturing imperfections due to the small scale, and hard-to-model aerodynamic effects induce large model errors, requiring robust controllers. Second, the small payload limits the onboard computation. Last, to maximize the lifespan of the components, control actions need to be planned in a way that accounts for actuation constraints and usage. In this work, we present the first MPC-like control strategy for sub-gram aerial robots, capable to account for actuation constraints and usage, while accounting for model and environment uncertainties. Our controllers run on a small off-board computer at 2 kHz, achieving in experiments a 60% reduction in trajectory tracking errors compared to our previous work. The key to our approach is to leverage a computationally efficient neural network that is trained to imitate the response of a trajectory tracking robust tube model predictive controller. The neural network is combined with an adaptive attitude controller and a cascaded control scheme. We evaluate our strategy in three tasks. First, we consider a 3 cm ramp on the X, Y, and Z axes, with a velocity up to 5.2 cm per second. The task is repeated three times. Here we show the actual and desired positions, orientation, and the external torque estimated by our adaptive strategies. We highlight that we achieve a maximum root mean square error of 0.9 cm and a maximum absolute error of only 1.6 cm. Next, we apply large external disturbances using a stick, causing large position and orientation errors. Despite these large disturbances, the robot can recover quickly, in only about 200 milliseconds. The orange shaded area in the plot highlight the impact times. Surprisingly, the maximum altitude tracking error is only 0.3 cm. Last, we consider a vertical circular trajectory, with 5 cm radius and a maximum desired velocity of 5.26 cm per second. The task is repeated three times. These results, which show the desired and actual position across the three runs, highlight the high tracking accuracy of our approach. We also highlight the role of the adaptive attitude controller, which is capable to compensate for external torque disturbances that correspond to up to 30% of the total torque that the robot can produce.